What's up, YouTube? I'm Gabriel. We're opening up Bakemon Tagamare, the English edition. Uh, this looks like it's a pretty interesting set from what I've seen so far. I don't know how it ranks as, you know, on tier uh, compared to the rest of the English meta. It's either really good or really bad. So, let's find out. What we get in here. I got this mainly just to see what are the rares and commons and stuff we need. And it looks like we got the box topper, pure looking clothing girl. Uh, it looks like she's just a generic 500 assist. So we'll leave that up there. Alright, so. Bake Montagamari. Let's find out what we get in here. So. Uh, it looks like just Encore guy. Um, Rainy Dunlow choose up to one of your opponent's characters. That character gets minus 3,000 power to the end of the turn. Not bad. Her. And. Just plus one level and one soul. Huh. Oh. Subasa Cat. That kitty cat. Um, should you take her up to one strange character, reveal it to your opponent, put in your hand. So, they have a Rota. Huh. Interesting. Back up. Oh, there's the, uh, zombie. Or the level one suicider, excuse me. Um, next pack. Kubanara. Oh, looks like he's just a generic two for one. And level one backup. Level one backup always too strong. Um, close chick. Oh, wow. GG. This thing's like 35 bucks. Got my fourth. That takes care of one problem. This chick. Scissors. I'm gonna have to read some of these later. In my opinion, this box paid for itself. This chick. In the encore. Chick. She's three for two for sixty five. That's interesting. She's one of the weaker threes I've seen in this game. Uh, basic backup. More basic backup. Experience. Okay, I don't understand how at any point in this game you would ever have stuff like or an experience of six, you know, early game. Next pet. I'm gonna steam rolling along here. Yep, I'm gonna have to read these. Next up. Scissor chick. More level one backup. 
Um, tap one. Choose character gets assist. Oh, we got one of the basic gates. This chick. Is this a pay two? Now this card spend your waiting room and your stage room. If you do choose a strange card, the waiting room returns your hand. That's not bad. Two for two. Um, do, 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 do. I see a bonder. Or you could just not open this check. Level one back up again. When a card named Sugar Monkey is in your climax zone, yep, I'm just gonna exit that card away. This guy, another one of her. Back up. So you just place on your stage, reveal the top card of your deck. If the reveal card is a climax, uh, return it to your deck. Uh, and the Monaco Sake. Scissors. Huh. We got the uh, super rare level three girl, Sugura uh, Kambaru. Huh. Speak of the devil, got another one of her. Next up, more Neko Neko. And last pack. This chick. Interesting. Oh, we got the Neko Neko gal. So we only got one gate in that entire box. Not terrible, but definitely not good. So guys, leave a comment down below, tell me what you guys thought, hope you guys enjoyed this box opening, and I'm out. I hope you guys enjoyed this video, please thumbs up this video to show your support, and please check out Vancole 40 for Cardfight Vanguard, M. Cole Games for miscellaneous trading card games, and No Limit Gaming for a brand new series of Yu-Gi-Oh! videos. Thanks for watching.